Um, this is Nicole George um, reporting back on the media fast that I did. I did it from February 2nd from 12 a.m. to um, February 3rd, 12 p.m. And honestly, it wasn't all too bad because, um, well, one, I don't have cable, so I don't watch all too much TV. And then um, secondly, I was actually... Um, out of town. I went to Greensboro and so most of the people that I text I was actually with them so that was it made things a lot easier. Um, some things that I did find difficult though was whenever um, I went out to, into public and um, like I went out to eat with my boyfriend and um, on, it was like a pretty narrow restaurant, so on both sides, because we were facing each other, obviously, and um, <laughs> there was a TV like right ahead and a TV right behind me, so he was watching um, the TV in front of him, and the TV right in front of me had an Asian soap opera playing, so it looked really interesting <laughs> from whenever I glanced at it, and I was like, damn it. I really want to be watching this, but, um, <clears throat> yeah, other than that, um, usually what I did a lot of was, um, I people watched, and, which I do, <laughs> um, regularly, and, um, it was just, instead of me, like, looking down at my phone, I would just be making eye contact with people or just staring at them for a long time, just kind of going on in a daze. And, um, I guess that's kind of awkward because I guess I don't know what to do in, like, situations where I would be looking at my phone or, like, playing a game on my phone or scrolling on Instagram. Um, but another thing that I noticed was that whenever I went to, um, this place, this place called, um, Jake's Billiards, and um, there's TVs everywhere. And um, we were sitting at the bar, and so they're like staring right down at us. So I was really tempted to just be like staring up at it. But um, instead, I just like looked at all the drinks behind the bar. <laughs> like, oh, I like that bottle. <laughs> that bottle's really pretty. Or I looked at, oh, would you look at that? Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Um, but I would, like, look at the taps and stuff, like, the sweet water, they have a huge fish <laughs> on their tap, so I guess that would be, um, yeah, that's <laughs> where my focus went to, and I guess whenever I was playing pool and it wasn't my turn, I would just be listening to other people's conversations, um, like, <laughs> the pool table right beside of us. Um... And then um, I played apples to apples, which was nice. But whenever it wasn't someone's turn, um, like, or they already placed their cards down, they would, like, look at their phone. So I was really tempted to do that whenever I was, like, bored and waiting because it was a really long game. So um, I noticed that. I noticed a lot of people getting on their phones and, like, how much they're, like, Oh, yep, 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 okay. And then a few seconds later, be like, oh, wait, oh, did, did, did. <laughs> um, and then other than that, <clears throat> what else? Uh, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I mean, it really wasn't all too bad. Oh, one thing I did do, um, because everyone was, like, talking and I was bored, and I didn't want to, I wasn't sleepy, so I didn't go to bed. So I read this book about paradoxes. <laughs> and it was called This Book Does Not Exist. And it was actually really interesting. I don't think that would be considered media. Yeah. But, yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in class. <laughs>